Don't forget to smash that like button. Subscribe to the channel. And remember guys, this is for adults. Guys, don't forget to check me out on Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest. Find all the photos that you want of these videos. What's up, you guys? It's Zach Jack Dan back with another top 10 list. This time we're talking about the top 10 best toy reveals of the week. This may be a recurring video. If you guys enjoy it, let me know. Let's get started. So first things first, I'm going to go through all the reveals that did not make the top 10 and did not make honorable mention so we can be aware of what was revealed this week so stay tuned and we'll get to the honorable mentions and the top 10 but here we go so let's start off this week with the disney toy box venom figure here We've got the ooze as well that comes with him or slime if you want to call it We've got those tentacles coming off his back as well from his symbiote and you can see right there the vial that you can stick into his bag to get the ooze to come out of his mouth, so that's pretty cool. Got a bunch of Legos here, starting off with the Infinity Saga Avengers Battle, in-game battle I should say, 76237. And then we have a Lego set 76238, which is the 66 Batman cow. And we have a Lego Darth Vader Meditation Chamber, 75296. And we we'll got some Jurassic World stuff coming out, 763, nope, 76939. 129 pieces. I'm not even going to try to pronounce this, but it's a Dinosaur Escape with a Jeep there and the several figures. There's the figures the set. You got set number 76940, the T-Rex Dinosaur Fossil exhi Exhibition. Pretty cool. And then you have the 76941 Carnotaurus Dinosaur Chase. Got the chopper and the vehicle there. A couple figures. Pretty cool. And then one more, 76942, Baronox Dinosaur Boat Escape. Not bad right there. All right, jumping into a early release. Uh, this hit the stores before Hasbro was able to re reveal what they got, but we have a Walmart exclusive 3 3 quarter inch retro G.I. Joe Stalker and Cobra Trooper figure coming out soon. There's the back of those cards. From Boss Flight Studios, we had seen some teases for Popeye earlier and his crew. Here's the first images of the new Popeye figure. Crushing his can of spinach there. Nice close up of him. And here's those teases we saw earlier. So we'll like to see those whenever they come out as well. From Transformers, Hasbro has given us a Battle Across Time Collection Kingdom War for Cybertron Trilogy 2 back here with a Maximal Skywarp and Sideswipe. So there's those two figures. Nice looking Sideswipe figure. And here's your Skywarp. Some third party Transformers also. Cyber Factory CF01, Star Storm, which is, of course, a Cybertron Starscream remake. Really cool looking third party. Another third party is your Mech Fans Toys MS18C Steel Ambition. Color image of this Astro Train figure. Another third party, or Diaclone I should say, you got the Reboot DA-79 Battle Convoy V Shadow. It's a USA exclusive.
Pretty cool convoy there. It looks like we got a little leak here of a Kingdom Tracks redeco as a Generation Select, possibly. Road Rage. Another third party fan hobby MB18 core robot prototype images here. We talked about this one last week. Revealed images from a third party APC Toys Dark Master Black Crystal clear version. You always got to like it when you get a clear toy, right? It's a nice looking Megatron third party. Transformer Studio Series 73 has given us our Grinder and Ravage first look. And there it is in package. Another third party, GDW 03B Dark Blade, Black Six Shot. Got the nice sword. Put him in blasters as well and there he is in his different modes so that is pretty awesome from McFarland toys we got some witcher revealed get your wild hunt Siri if I pronounce that right I'm not so sure and our new Geralt of Rivera in his wolf armor so there he is in package and loose got that nice head there two swords the flame effect of course, the base on all these McFarlane toys. Front and back here. And sides. And here's your Siri. Got that really cool effect on her sword there. In package. And there's her effect on her base as well. And all her different angles. Sticking with McFarlane, here is the pre-order information for this. And here is some more McFarlane. You've got your Avatar of the Legends of Aang figures. We think these is the 5 inch, could be the 7 inch, not 100% sure. You got your Aang, Katara, Sokka, Prince Zuku, and Appa. A little leak here from your DC Multiverse Snyder Cut McFarlane toys. You got your Batman Platinum Edition figure here. You got the goggles on his head. Ben Affleck here. From Mezco, you got your de designer series Mega Scale It at 19.90 Talking Pennywise, 15 inch, 11 points of articulation, 98 bucks for this guy. Pop, you got your deluxe Iron Man 2, Iron Man with the Gantry, previous exclusive here. It does glow in the dark or something there. And then you have another, what do you call it, Shwar Shwarma series, Captain America here this time. And Jada Toys, looks like we're getting some Universal Monsters. So you got your Bride of Frankenstein, Creature from the Black Lagoon, Frankenstein's Monster, and Dracula. So this would be pretty interesting. I'm not sure what the scale is on these though. We have our Beast Kingdom EAA0875P Toxin Egg Attack figure. And then we have a little leak here or tease for June 17th pre order starting into the Spider Verse from Sentinel Toys for a Peter B. Parker. Alright, so jumping into the honorable mentions for the So it looks like Target is putting out a five pack for the Batman Beyond. So that'll be very interesting to see what that actually turns out to be. From far on towards the DC Universe, or DC Multiverse. Looks like Target is also getting a Amber Collection for Mattel Jurassic World um, exclusives. We'll see what those are. And Mattel also here is leaked a image from Amazon for a Olar figure from the Motu Origins. Not the uh, Wind Raider there, but just the Olar figure itself. And then also with McFarlane Toys, we got a bunch of leaks of some new figures that should be coming soon. The most exciting for me, probably the Lex Luthor Power Suit, the Lobo figure. Um, a lot of the Jokers could be cool there, probably. Killing Joke, Death in the Family. 
Got your Swamp Thing Mega Figure. And you got some McFarlane Toys Mortal Kombat's as well. Shao Kahn Platinum, Liu Kang, Kotal Khan, and a Joker. Interesting. And then uh, Super 7 looks like they're going to be putting out some reaction figures for G.I. Joe. So check that out. Can't wait to see those. And also with Super 7, they did a little tease that maybe our first wave of the Ultimates Silver Hawks will be the Quicksilver, Monstar, Buzzsaw, and Steelheart. So we'll see if that is true. And then this Wednesday is going to be Fan First Wednesday for Hasbro and Star Wars. So exciting to see that on Hasbro Pulse. So here we are at the top 10 part of the week. So here are the top 10 best toy reveals of the week. So at number 10 from Loose Collector, we got this Kofin series for the Lady Death Hail Witch Legacy 112 scale. Got that green sword, the flame effect, the nice wings. Here's what the packaging should look like, something similar to this. And here she is in action. Pretty cool figure. At number 9 from SH Monster Arts or SH Fidget Arts Tamashi Nations. You got this huge 7 in, 17 inch long tail for the Godzilla Singular Point. Nice Godzilla figure here. Got that massive mouth open wide. Crazy articulation that tail, right? At number 8 from Beast Kingdom, you have a dynamic action or action heroes Joker deluxe figure from the Dark Knight. So you got your Heath Ledger here, the handcuffs, soft goods. Really cool figure by Beast Kingdom. And number seven, we're gonna jump back into McFarlane Toys and we do see a, our first look at our Suicide Squad from the DC Multiverse from the movie. So you got your King Shark, which is, should be your mega scale gold label. Your Harley Quinn, Bloodsport, Polka Dot Man. And we also got our Peacemaker. It's a really cool reveal there. And also stick with McFarlane, you have their 6-inch Retro 66 Batman figures. Batmobile, Batcave, Batman himself, Robin, and Joker. At number 6, sticking with the Batman here, we got your Star Ace Toys, Batman Ninja, Modern Batman. 300 bucks for this guy. 12-inch scale, or 12 inches, 1-6 scale. Really cool looking figure. Soft goods cape. Gotta love these Batman ninjas that this Star Ace has been doing. Got the head sculpt there as well. Light up effect in his forehead. Number five from SH Figure Arts, you got your Tech Own Avengers reveals. So here's what we're looking to see in the future here with your Iron Man Cap, Spidey, Black Panther, Captain Marvel, Wolverine, Red Skull, Loki, and Venom. But here's our first look at, Sp at Iron Man and Captain America. That nice massive pack on his back. And here's that Captain America. It's also sticking with SH Figure Arts in this same number. You got your Hawkeye and your Black Widow for the first time seen. SH has done a lot of reveals this week, really cool. And also, they got your Vision from the WandaVision. You got your green and yellow and your white version Paul Bettany playing this white vision and number four from Hot Toys you get your 1-6 scale quill and blurg figure of course you can get the quill by himself here nice little right up on quill but you can also get him with the Blurg as a deluxe figure here. So really cool that you can get it in two different ways. Of course, this is I think the third time we've seen the Blurg. Got him individually and he came with also the Mandalorian. <clears throat> so really cool, I love these hot toys. Such good detail. And number three, this was actually on my list last week, but guess what? It gave us even more from 3-0 and the fact that this is going to also come where you can open him up and 
There's so many pictures. There we go. This is why he's on the list now. I did not realize that he had an Iron Man that came inside of him as well. So he made the list again whenever 3 Zero actually provided the real images of this Hulkbuster from the Infinity Saga. So 3 Zero did it again. Wow. So many images. So good. And number two, the Fan First Friday for G.I. Joe and Hasbro. Here is our heavy artillery roadblock. And of course, that was up on pre-order on Amazon if you didn't get it. Also shows off the Alpha Commando Snake Eyes and Timber 2-pack here. 40 bucks. So come up for pre-order this Thursday. There's the artwork. And it's cool. Timber actually has two different head sculpts. Then we have a Cobra Island Target exclusive of our Gabriel Barbecue Kelly. Got two different axes. Got his backpack, of course. And there's the artwork on that one. And you can see Major Blood kicking his tail there. We also had another Cobra Island Breaker with his Ram Cycle. So another Target exclusive. Hopefully it's not as hard to find as that Baroness was. Got the big Gatling gun. Helmet that goes on his head there as well. That is everything from the Fan First Friday for the G.I. Joe Classified that they revealed. But they did show us some images of our Major Blood here. And hopefully Major Blood will get a restock soon. Nice artwork on that figure as well. And at number one, man, they teased us here. They showed off the Wolverine figure with his beat up face there from toying around on YouTube. And they showed off the Omega Red repaint. Uh, annoying you with friendship. There she is with both in hand. Kind of comparing the two, what we're going to see. And then we got a cyber figure revealed by Shardimus. And we're still thinking, okay, was it going to be a retro wave or something? There's a nice comparison of sizes. But no, they came out and gave us an Amazon box set with all five of these figures in it. Out of nowhere. So get out there and get that pre-order in if you hadn't already. There's the back of that package. There's all five figures with all their accessories. Amazon exclusive, there's the link if you need to type it down. Yeah, sure. Shardimus giving us a Cyber, Foosh giving us Callisto, Mastermind was super, was super Sorrel, Wolverine touring around, and Omega Red was annoying you with friendship. So crazy, guys. So guys, what do y'all think about this top 10 list for the week? Mentions? Would you guys have put one of the other ones on this list? Did you enjoy this week's reveals? Let me know in the comments. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video of the top 10 best toy reveals of the week. Leave any kind of comments that you want. Hit that notification bell so you're aware of any new videos that I have. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I'll talk to you guys later. Hey guys, don't forget to check me out on Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest find all the photos that you want of these videos.